Hi, my name is Allison Pattison. I'm an assistant professor of physics at Syracuse University. Inside our cells are tiny microscopic filaments that act as the internal scaffold of the cell. These filaments are called the cell cytoskeleton, and it is made up of three different polymeric networks, F-actin, microtubules, and intermediate filaments. Intermediate filaments take on diverse forms and are associated with more than 80 distinct human diseases. Vimentin is a type of intermediate filament protein that forms beautiful intricate networks which give the cell its strength, but vimentin also contributes to cell signaling networks. In many respects, vimentin is still a mysterious protein. For instance, many forms of cancer are associated with the overexpression of vimentin, but its role in even basic cellular functions such as cell migration and cell proliferation remain poorly understood. To examine Vimentin's role in cell motility, in recent years, we developed microfluidic channels that mimic the 3D nature of tissues. Using fibroblasts that were derived from wild type and Vimentin on mice, we showed that loss of Vimentin increases cell motility through 3D channels. These results provide evidence that the rigidity of the Vimentin network resists the compressive forces when cells are being physically confined in space, and thus Vimentin might slow down individual cell speeds inside real tissue. This work motivated us to look more closely at the cell nucleus. The nucleus is a major determining factor when it comes to how fast cells can squish and squeeze their way through small spaces. Vimentin is known for forming a mesh-like cage that encircles the nucleus. Using a series of different 3D cell motility assays, we showed that this Vimentin cage protects the cell against DNA damage and even prevents nuclear envelope rupture during the cell migration process. These results have important implications for understanding the role of Vimentin in maintaining the stability of the nuclear genome and protecting the cell against cell death. Zooming out from the cell nucleus and the cell interior, vimentin can be found on the outside surface of the cell, so-called extracellular vimentin. This is vimentin that has escaped its position in the interior of the cell and acts as signals between cells, but also between cells and invading pathogens such as viruses. A 2017 paper from UNL suggests that extracellular vimentin mediates cellular uptake of the SARS-1 virus. Might extracellular vimentin mediate SARS-2 cell uptake? And can vimentin antibodies be used to block the spread of COVID-19? Hopefully research will soon yield the answer. This work is supported through an NIH program project grant led by Robert Goldman. We are a group of over 30 vimentin researchers from six institutions. Our laboratories meet every three weeks and are supported by a consortium of NSF and NIH grants. This video accompanies a bioassays article in which we review findings from three areas of active vimentin research, including cell signaling roles, interactions with the cell nucleus, and extracellular vimentin. Please see the bioassays article for a detailed description. Thanks.